Hey, what's up guys? It's Gathalian and welcome back to Borderlands Classic, the Survival Guide. In this series, we're talking about Borderlands 1, how awesome it is, and a little tips and tricks going into it, considering that a lot of gamers just never got around to playing Borderlands Classic because, well, their first Borderlands soiree was Borderlands 2. And with the, uh, the recent link of a maybe Borderlands Remastered, I was like, you know what, fuck it, I know a lot about this game, let's go back and talk about it because I fucking love it. Today we're going to talk about my favorite chest run in the game, and that is inside the Crimson Fastness. Any Borderlands, uh, sort of, I don't know, <coughs> veterans are going to be like, Meh, I knew about that, but yeah, you're yeah, fucking up, but you know what? Not, Not everybody, everybody knew, knew about, about it. it! I got some new toys. Anyways, so you're going to want to do this run through the Crimson Fastness. A few of these chests won't always be here. It only spawns X amount of chests as you're going through. A couple spots are always worth checking. A few spots won't always be there, but you should always check all the spots. You can go through, get upwards five chests, six chests, whatever. I think it's like five all the way through, and I have found some awesome gear through here. So if you're getting towards the end of the game and you're needing some new gear going in to fight the Destroyer of Worlds, which I don't know why anybody would, but you could get it here. This is an absolutely awesome chest run. In fact, I would say it rivals that inside Nox's Farmery, outside the fact that pearls can't drop here, unfortunately, because it's inside the base game. Um, outside of that, the uh, Crimson guys are fun to kill. They're fun to fight. It's a very quick chest run, and once they patched New Haven to not spawn red chests anymore, this became your go-to option inside the vanilla game to get your chest run. So that'll about wrap it up, guys. Go out there, run your chest. Go out, go out for a little nostalgia, man. If, if you are uh, been away from Borderlands Classic for a long time, go out and do your nostalgia chest run. It feels good. It feels good to fucking wipe the floor with these motherfucking Lance guys. It feels real fucking good. And as always, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys back inside Borderlands Classic.